I'm going to show you how you can strip the DRM from content that you bought through a Windows Media Player uh, store so that you can decide how you can play your media and not let the DRM tell you how. So first what you do is you go to this website forum dot blah 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 <laughs> it'll be uh, listed in the description of the video and then you download uh, one of these to download this and what you do with this is uh, the zip file is you open up this this file right here uh, and you click start and let it, it, let it do its thing. It's looking for the uh, keys that um, are used to encrypt your media files that you bought. So then you click exit and then you open Fair Use for Windows Media. Uh, and then from there, uh, make sure you change the output to same directory, use same directory. And then you go to your music folder. From there, you need to find all of the media that you, um, well, in this case, music, that is copy protected. So right click on this top bar and click protected. And then click hover over protected and click this down arrow and click stack by protected. And then you double click on yes. And then click on one of them and press control A to select all of them and then drag them into fair, your, fair use for Windows Media. And then what you do is click Next. You watch it as it strips the DRM from all of your music or videos. Yeah, you can buy it. You can uh, download movies and TV shows through some of the stores, I guess. Uh, and in this case, I have a whole bunch so, uh, <clears throat> I think maybe I'll cut the video and then come back when it starts working. Or when it's done. Yeah. Okay, so it, uh, here you can see it converted all the files perfectly and there weren't any errors, errors and all that. So you click finish and the thing is, it doesn't really convert them, as in uh, overwrite the originals, it makes copies. Like, if I go uh, music, and I know that I have a U2 album that's copy protected. So here are all the ones with the DRM stripped, and here are the original ones. So what you can do now is just right click here and click delete, because you know that there are, uh, these are the DRM copies, and you know you have DRM free copies uh, elsewhere. So you do that, it'll uh, it'll delete all those uh, silly DRM musics, I guess, music uh, files, and now you can do whatever you want with your music.